You want to go shopping? Let's shop. This is the second in my series of shop local, support local, small business, share the love. Last week, I took you to one of my favorite consignment shops. This is my shopping destination for today. And you all said you wanted more. You said that was so fun, let's do it again. So I thought, hey, let's do it again. Why not? I'm game and I'm not in the city. I am in my teeny tiny country town of Creemora, Ontario. And I want to introduce you to one of my favorite shops that I love. This is Miller Island. Everybody meet Travis and Miller Island. And you know I love treasure hunting, vintage furnishings, wicker, bamboo, anything, and everything that is all about coastal style. And currently I am wearing a winter jacket because it's still cold. However, my mind has gone to all things water-based and coastal and dreamy and summery. And some of my absolute favorite treasures that you have seen, that you have loved, came from this little shop. So let's go. Let's shop. I'm going to shop not for me. I'm shopping for you. And take you on a guided tour and show you what I would buy and tell you why I love it. One day. Let's go. Let's go. See, look. Two versions of it. That means I get the whole place to myself. Okay. Right in the door. This is taking me back to my childhood. I swear my aunt and uncle had this very sofa, different upholstery, but yes, this is reminding me of my childhood. I think this is a great line, plywood frame, super cool, $690. Let's be clear, I would definitely reupholster this. I know that people are loving this color right now. This color seems to be very on trend. This is not my color palette, so I would reupholster it. Do you remember the Midtown Reno? The Midtown Reno that we did? This is a travertine table, $790 on a great pedestal base. This is a chic piece. Keep in mind, it is low, okay? Sits really nice and low. What else am I loving here? What else, what else? Ooh, these are fun. Look at these, natural footstools. You could use them as a footstool. You could use them as a little bench. Nice, light, bleached, beachy. Oh, you know where these would look really great? These would look really great as a pair at the foot of the bed. And they are 225 each. This table, why is this table still here? I have admired this table so many times. This is what gets me into trouble because I come in and then I think, oh, I should just buy this table. But I have a hanger full of stuff. I can read this through here. I think it says that this is $390. And it has a fabulous frame underneath it. Look how sculptural this is. So you could leave it exactly as is because there is some beautiful color texture that you're getting there from the rattan. But also if you wanted it to be a different color, you could paint. I love it as is. I would keep it as is. I would actually consider putting a marble top on it. You wouldn't see the sculptural base in the same way, but it would be pretty snazzy dressed up with a piece of marble. And I'm gonna say that is 36 inches in diameter. Okay, let's talk about some little things. Everybody needs a little things. This is where I often come and find great little accessories, finishing touches, bits and bobs. You love coastal style, you wanna to listen to the ocean. The ocean is calling. I can't get there because travel's illegal, but $29 for that little cutie. Lovely little vase to set beside it. $30 for the vase. Okay, chic little planter pots. Ideal for you put a succulent, cactus, maidenhair fern, orchid, or insert other live thing for your green thumb. Okay, 26, $30, great finish, nice and smooth, bit speckled, good contemporary look. Do you want your furniture to be a cover star? Well, that's always what I want. Do you recognize this chair? This chair, not this very chair, but a chair exactly like this, a pair of chairs exactly like this, I bought here from Travis for our cottage. And I absolutely love them because they swivel and they rock. These are some rockin' swivel chairs. They are crazy comfortable. They are chic, they are lovely, they are amazing. I put them in the cottage. You probably saw them on my Design Life series. And then, 
They were on the cover of Hez Beautiful magazine, my friends. And look, here's one here. Do you want it? Do you need it? And the price on this is $3.95. Now, I made custom seat and back cushions for mine, but this is clever because if you want a kind of loose look, a 26 inch pillow just fits beautifully in here. And if you're thinking, how am I going to shop because I don't live in your small town, Sarah, this is where Instagram comes in. I want you to follow Travis's account. If you're interested in buying something, you can always DM, that's direct message, Travis, and his account is Miller underscore Island on Instagram. So you can shop for what I'm shopping for, for you, or you can shop for whatever you want, or you can get in touch and purchase. Okay, I love this chair. Speaking of cottagey things, how about these? These are fun. Cute pair of white wicker side tables. Look, shelves. They're already white, so you don't have to paint them. They have a little gallery around the top, so this could easily hold a piece of glass, or you could get a piece of marble. Cut on here, cut on here, cut for here. Sarah, try and speak. These are $2.25 each. You could use these on the ends of a sofa as side tables, or you could use these as bedside tables, so that makes a nice casual look. Okay, ooh, cute chair here. Okay. This chair, this is a low chair. This is not for people 6'6". Six, six. I feel like I'm getting a new hairdo while I'm sitting here. I think I saw, a, oh, yeah, price. 300 for this. This is a cool chair, I like this, a single chair. You've also seen in the shows, I've used lots of single chairs. A single chair in a bedroom just up the street was where we filmed Sarah Off the Grid season two and I used rattan chairs into the bedroom. So think about that. You need a little chair, here's a little chair, $300. This is a fun cabinet, it's kind of blush. Golden Girls, hands up right now, do you love the Golden Girls or do you not love the Golden Girls? Okay, I love the Golden Girls. I grew up watching the series, I love that series and I have a sentimentality for all things Golden Girls. I don't necessarily want my house to look like the Golden Girls though. So I'm gonna tell you this is blush right now. I'm not sure that I would keep it blush. Chairs, more chairs. Some suddenly seen double. There was one of these chairs at the front. There's two more here. These apparently are 300 each, 600 the pair. Okay, so there's a lot of these chairs here. This is a chair moment. Another chair. This is all about chairs. Last week I was finding everything about lighting. This week is all about chairs. I like this chair. This chair is snazzy, a great bedroom chair. If you're thinking cottagey and you're thinking stripey, this fabric is nice. I think this has just been washed. It's vintage, it's chic ticking. This is $390. I'm going to look at it from all sides. I'm gonna, this one doesn't spin, so I gotta spin it. Look at that. That is a sculptural chair. You know that when I'm shopping for chairs, I'm always looking for something that is Sculptural. This will hold a room. Think of this in your guest room or in your favorite sunny spot. Check it out. This is missing its cushion, but this is supposed to be a footrest. And there are two of these, and they are $160 each. And here, here it is with a little glass top, so you could use it as a table. So they could be low side tables beside a sofa. I want you to imagine that. Or they could be bench at the foot of the bed, or they can be a footrest. Aren't we always looking for versatile solutions? Okay, one of my favorite things to do is creep around behind in the back of the store. So these aren't actually really ready to be sold yet because they need to be polished apparently. But I have these exact vintage sailboats at the cottage, 45 and $30. They're just a charming thing, you know? And sometimes you find it, you think, oh, that's one of a kind. Okay, they're not actually one of a kind. I've found a bunch of these. These are. Well, actually, Travis has found a bunch of these and I find them when I come here. Okay, speaking of finds, I have been wanting to use director's chairs somewhere for a while. There are three of these in the shop. They are $200 each. Look at this, a little canvas slip. I always thought it'd be great to do a dining table with director's chairs, but I could not convince my husband to go for it. I don't know why, they're really comfortable. This is comfortable, I like these. These could be nice extra chairs in a living room. If you want something petite, if I'm coming over to your house when this pandemic is over, because it will be over, and I'm just there for a little drink, 
I'm happy to sit in a chair like this. I do not need to be schlumped out on the sofa. If you're gonna really do a good job shopping, you need to look in the nooks and the crannies, you need to look under, you need to look up, you need to look down, you need to look around the back of the little camper van because there is a really cute headboard here. It's woven with a bamboo detail. I can't tell you if it's a double or a queen, but it's one of the two and it's $300. Alrighty, what else? Ugh, this table. How is this table still here? I've looked at this table a number of times and I just haven't bought this table because in any given home, you can only have so many tables. So I've never found a home for this table, but I think it's really cute. Look at this little spiral shape on the inside. Beautiful pale blonde rattan, $200. There's only one, but this is a lovely little side table. How fun are these? If boho is your thing, and you imagine that you actually don't live here, but you live in Tulum, I think you probably need these pendants. They're 225 each in a cottage above your kitchen island or above your dining table. So fun. A last minute costume party and you need a hat, you can just wear the lampshade. These are perfect. Nice bookshelf here. I like this bookshelf. Everybody needs more storage. $3.95 for this, great lines. Look at this rounded silhouette and what would this go well with? This would go well with my favorite swivel chairs or the pair of little footstools slash tables that I suggested at the foot of the bed or that chair with the ticking stripe on it. You see, you could just group all like things together and you could have an instant awesome rattan room. Maybe that's what I need. I just might need a rattan room in my life. Who's getting you? I basically have some rattan rooms. I like these. Round on the top, square on the bottom, round peg, square hole, round top, square bottom, 22 and $26. Really nice stoneware glaze. Not old, just nice. Just like them, just appreciating them. That makes me a toast as good. Oh, these are fun. Did you guys watch my campaign for wool video? where I created rugs all made with Canadian wool, and then we did a photo shoot and created these wool rooms. Well, that's a long way of telling you about what these tables are like. I bought a pair of tables from here that are really fun, and these are a more petite version. Look at this, travertine with this ball and a little glass top. If you want a conversation piece, this is it, okay? This is uh, $340, and there are two of them and they're cool. These are fun, okay? These are, oops, not vintage, locally made. They can be done in raw wood or painted the color of your choice. Really comfortable. Are we thinking about outdoor living? I am thinking it is time to get back to outdoor living and I think these are really fun. All right, so that's it, that's my tour. I mean, I could tell you about every single thing in the store, but look, scan your eyes. What else did I want to tell you about that I got from here? Oh, even, okay, during the pandemic, it has been so hard for retailers. It has been so hard for small shops. But you know what I do? I come and I window shop. So a long time ago, when I was trying to finish our retro ranch reno, I came and window shopped through that window right there and I bought a really cute console and stool that I put in the bunk room at the Retro Ranch Rena. So you know what I want you to do? I want you to scroll through. I want you to think about whether you need anything that I've shown you today. You know what to do. You can send a direct message and then you can stay tuned for our next Let's Shop. Cause you know what I think we're gonna do? I think we're gonna do it again. Thanks for joining. Want to make sure you never miss an episode? Make sure you hit the button to subscribe and don't forget to click the bell for notifications and you'll be able to follow us on our design life journey each and every day.